Hello, congratulations for your title. Thanks. You must be you very relieved after the game of today. Yeah, I'm relieved and I'm very happy that it's uh, finished. This was a fantastic tournament, but it's also nice to, that it's finished already and that, uh, that I won gold. I made a short interview with you after five games. You are five out of five. The yes. next day you lost to Antonetta. <laughs> yeah, that's true. What you thought about uh, during the evening after losing this six game? Well, actually, um, at the point when I was leading uh, with five out of five, I actually didn't didn't uh, think it was very important yet because I sort of I imagined that my real opponent, well, the one I will have to sort of compete against will be plus six or plus seven. So someone winning the tournament will have that much. Mm -hmm. So sort of uh, leading a Swiss tournament like that, I mean, it doesn't matter until the very last round, basically. So I thought it's just a nice start, but okay, that doesn't really matter so mm -hmm. much. And you showed fantastic uh, fighting spirit. You won eight games out of 11. Yeah, well, not today, though. <laughs> today I just made a safe draw, but it's true. This is, yeah, I didn't make that many draws, and it was... Well, okay, quite some things, they actually worked out very nicely for me, so I mean some preparation and some just, I had my share of luck I think too. Mm -hmm. During a, lo uh, a lot of games I saw you were uh, something like one hour ahead of your opponent. Yeah, that's true. Preparation worked out very well, no? Uh, sorry, yeah, that's uh, most of the time, <laughs> yeah. Uh, how you were preparing? Well, I was here alone, so I mean, I just, I was preparing uh, with my computer and uh, Mm -hmm. Getting some advice. And mm -hmm. When did you feel uh, that you can be really the champion? Well, I mean, I, I was quite worried today before the game because, I mean, I actually have three, three silver medals already. So, all, well, quite so many times things didn't work in, in the very end. So, so I thought, okay, well, I, I was really hoping today wouldn't be too, too, too tough a game and, and it worked out quite, quite easily. But, I mean, I didn't really believe it until the very end. So. Uh -huh. And what makes the, the difference, let's say, between uh, last year and this year? What, what is the smallest difference which makes you a champion? Well, I think, actually this year I could see that things were really working out well. I won a lot of games very quickly and, uh, I mean, you know, there is only a certain amount of things that one can control, but then the circumstances have to be also favorable. And I could see that this time, really, I mean, the circumstances were nice for me somehow. Mm -hmm. Very few people know about your life. Uh, where are you living, generally speaking? I live in a small uh, city in, in Lithuania. It's called Shouli. I Well, I have two sons. They are nine and seven. So mm -hmm. this is mainly sort of... When I'm at home, I'm a full-time mother, basically, mm -hmm. and, uh, you know... And then sometimes I go to chess tournament. <laughs> Do you find time to, to work daily uh, with well, your kids? Not a lot. No, actually, uh, I don't work that much at home. But I mean, I uh, sort of when I get a chance, I I would say I mainly I really enjoy playing chess when I get a chance to. And uh, it's not the easiest thing to combine two things, but mm -hmm. but so far I manage. That's nice. <laughs>